Welcome everyone to the final. We're gonna just ask a few drivers, a few questions, see what their thoughts on this uh, on this track, a brand new track actually, and a few cars that are pretty much uh, not doing as great, but some cars doing as uh, as good as some other cars. So we'll start with who we'll start with. I think when um, let's start with Paparazzi as a, a driver who finally. This season managed to make it into a fi uh, semi-final. This season, so uh, you think this track was the reason for your for your um, first semi-final? Uh, <laughs> yeah, so it was a, it was a very nice track to drive with uh, the Comet Retro. Uh, good feeling on this track, pretty flat and, and stable. So yeah, we could show a nice performance. Unfortunately, I had some troubles in semi-final, but. Yeah, I'm I'm very happy to 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 reach the, the semi-final. Well, it wasn't the final, but at least your teammate is in it. Do you think uh, it's going to be a hard battle for him? Uh, he showed some very very great performance uh, in in the qualifications and semi-final. So yeah, I, I will bet my money on on him. And Thank you very much, Paparazzi. Thank you for your uh, for a little bit of your time. We're going to move on to Psychomatic here, who is in the GV, one of the cars that hasn't been doing as great, but uh, managing to move on to the finale uh, on this round. So what are your thoughts on this track and uh, car combination for you? Well, I've been a bit lucky to win final, to be honest, because without Tempe crashing, I don't think I would have made it. I was a little bit too slow to be able to do it on a regular basis. Nonetheless, I'm glad to be here, and uh, with Cornelis just right next to me on the grid, we'll try to do what we can. Not gonna be easy, we have a lot of fast cars here, well, let's try to salvage a few points. So, what's gonna be your strategy, seeing you have a few fast cars in this uh, finale? Uh, I'm not quite sure, my strategy is gonna be to not crash, that would be a good one, yeah. I would, uh, no, no, no. I would now crash value is coming in handy, right? Handy yes. and uh, and maybe c and maybe solve some points if anyone in front of you crashes. That's what pretty much your uh, strategy gonna be this uh, for this finale. Yeah, my goal is pretty much to not lose too many points in CS Maloy because then it would be very close in the championship. Besides that, I think we are quite clear uh, for the fourth place after us. So yeah, let's try to not lose too many points on him, I guess. Thank you, Psychomatic, for a little bit of your time. And lastly, let's move on to the Japanese driver, Air Monkey. Let's, let's see uh, his thoughts on this uh, track. So, do you think it could have been uh, a lot of better uh, starting position over your uh, semi finale? Uh, yeah, um, I think I could have um, came first on the semi final, but apparently there was an incident on the last lap, so a shame. But luckily, we came to the final, so I'm pretty happy. What's your objective for the finale? Do you think you can get top three at least? Yeah, I think I can get top three as long as it's consistent and I'm trying myself and my team may have the same. So I'll try my best for today with my team and yeah. Thank you, Air Monkey, for a little bit of time. That is gonna be all for um for today. I hope the drivers in the finale a very good luck and a very good finale. Final of the round seven. Ready to race. Oh, it's a good start of coming in behind, but he was blocked by Nakoli. He took it for a great start of Nakoli. Oh, a bit of crash at the first turn between uh, Comedy and Air Monkey. Nothing to not a big deal, but many people went into the, the Joker. Two groups uh, behind the second group is going to mention Air Monkey and Psychomatic. Lap 2. Already can take lead of Nakadi. Now I'm took uh, on to the uh, lap. on this track, lap 3, he's taking his joker, I think it's a good strategy, have enough uh, space to take it 
safely. Good done. Cornell is uh, still in the second position. Rick says Mallory just behind him. Says Mallory over to Cornell on the inside. He's now in P2. From the machine he's with the very close of uh, Cornell also. Trying to take the third position to run the podium. He takes the interior and takes the third position. Cornell is jumped into the docker. Because between him and Air Monkey for the fourth position, Air Monkey takes the fourth position just in front of the delete for the driver, but no, Colonel is seven gear. It's too much his position. There is also battle between this one and Colonel Merchant for the second position. Mercury is still flying with his lead. Something happened for Connolly who is now behind Psychometric. Unfortunate for the arrow driver. And Mercury crossed the line in P1. Oh, and something happened between Chrono and CS Miller on the line. CS Miller is second, Chrono is third. A monkey fourth, psychomatic fifth, and Cornelius sixth.